Hi there guys, welcome back to another video. Uh, this is my quick guide to the SPR, uh, how to use a gun in five minutes or less. Thanks for coming back and watching this video here. Um, we are going through the SPR today um, on how to equip it and sort of a few tips and tricks on the weapon. Um, it's a great hybrid between sort of the more heavyweight snipers and the more lightweight car 98 as well. So it offers you some really great middle ground and to be honest, it's my favorite one in the game. Um, feels just mobile enough, but not um, <laughs> to sort of light hitting either. Um, so getting into the build then, look, um, early on you're probably going to want to equip the tactical suppressor. You're not going to unlock that monolithic suppressor for quite some time. Um, going over to the barrel as well, you want the SPR 26. Um, for the scope, you want the Solar Zero. Um, SPR 26 millimeter. Um, in terms of the ammunition, you want the Norma mag. Um, you want that over anything else. Trust me. In the since the latest nerfs and things like that, that's that's really what you want out of here. Um, on top of that as well, you do want the TAC laser equipped. Um, this is to help with the sort of um, aim down sight speed. Um, really useful. Just gets you there a little bit more. Um, I've played around with a number of. Um, the, uh, the number of attachments um, and to be honest it's, it's just really useful it helps you get that scope down just that little bit quicker um, now no matter what with this gun um, you hit pe you hit a person in the head um, with the plane bullet um, not stopping power bullets anything like that you will get a kill um, now the recent um, nerfs with the normal rounds they help with the bullet velocity um, so just generally choose them, it's really useful. The tack laser also helps the ADS and sort of the idle sway. Um, now, uh, do, do you know, with, with this weapon here, uh, the nerf was pretty much to um, its long range damage, um, and that, that was sort of um, 250 meters plus, really. So, do you know, for the best part, you're not really going to be uh, noticing. The, uh, the the nerf on it, um, and as you saw early on in this video as well, look, you're still going to be popping those heads as well. You hit them in the head, they are going down. So that's honestly not something to worry about. Um, also, you know, it's a strong enough gun to do a collateral with, um, as you'll see in just a moment here. Yeah, there you go. Um, you, you know, it's still got plenty of power on it. It's um, definitely a great gun, really mobile. Um, with that, just a few tips and tricks to this weapon is, um, you know, when you're peeking, make sure you're not peeking from the same spot. Make sure you're sort of swapping that up, especially if someone's got his eyes on you. Um, it just makes you a little bit less predictable. People don't quite know where to hide in cover as well. Um, yeah, just make sure you're sort of um, popping side to side uh, as much as you can, really. Swap from cover to cover, obviously, without sort of giving away your sort of position. Obviously, as well, whenever you're aiming down scope, um, you are giving that blint out to anybody that's looking towards you. Um, so that's something to really bear in mind. You want to really not be aiming down scope for really long extended periods of time. And I know, <laughs> as I say that, I'm currently doing that on screen. I was really just trying to line up that shot. And if anything, you could see me anyway. Um, probably could see the glint, but you know, he was trying to get himself behind cover. Um, but for the best part, you know, don't aim down for really long extended periods of time well look that's it uh, from me that's um, the SPR quick guide um, I'm looking to do the mp5 next if this is the kind of content that you'd like to see again don't forget to like and subscribe uh, comment as well if you want to see me to cover off any other weapons um, yeah look forward to seeing you next time thanks for watching bye bye oh nice <laughs>